Hey guys, it's Nate. Uh, it's June 16th at around, it's at 8pm I think. Um, and I am 8 months and 8 days on tea. <sighs> um, I feel like my voice has gotten a little bit deeper. I can't really tell, like at all. Um, I don't know. But I just feel like it's gotten deeper. I, I don't even know what I'm talking about, but, um, I think my face looks a little bit less feminine. I don't know. Um, my facial hair is starting to grow in a little bit more. Um, it's, the part that is growing in is, like, only, like, right here. Um, I have a little bit of sideburn action, um, and my mustache is a little, um, present. And I have a little bit right there. But, um, this is starting to come in more. Um, there was this huge patch missing there before, like, right in there. Um, but I started taking biotin last Monday. Actually, on my actual eight months day. <laughs> Oops. Um, and so it's a little less patchy now. Um, which is kind of nice. Um, I haven't seen a whole lot of changes though, uh, otherwise, um, as far as my, uh, top surgery consult goes, um, without getting into too much detail, because frankly, I don't want to, um, it's probably not, it's not going to happen until next summer, more than likely, if I'm lucky, um, maybe, maybe in the spring, if I'm lucky. Um, it hasn't been scheduled yet. Um, the surgeon was really nice, so it was, um, Emily Bridgeway at Dartmouth. Um, she was really nice, and, um, she knew what she was talking about. I mean, she's not one of the more, like, well-known names in the top surgery field. Like, I've, I've only ever heard of one other guy that's even gone to her for a consult. But, um, she, she clearly knows what she's doing, um, and I liked her a lot, so I think that when the time comes, she is who I will be going with, um, so, um, that's about it, though, um, I don't really have much to say today, so, I will see you guys at nine months. Bye.